It's uh, filming already. Okay. Right, so what we do is I don't like feeding with a normal syringe because sometimes the plunger will get sort of stuck and then as you're pushing it, it'll just suddenly go and just go all over your bird. So what I've done is I've modified this syringe by cutting a little triangular piece out so that um, the bird can drink straight out of it. A guy uh, who's on YouTube used a straw, but these days McDonald's decided in their wisdom to make <laughs> paper straws and it gets all yucky. So in the bin, we've got a plastic straw, which is from Burger King. And what you do to, to make it a, a straw uh, is just chop it off like that. And you can dip that into your formula and then feed it to your bird that way. But the syringe is better because it actually sucks up a decent amount of it. And with my bird being so hungry, he likes to... Um, gobble it down. So what I've got here is he was changing from golden lorry to this um, peckish lorikeet mix. So I've mixed the two 50-50 just to get him used to the new mix. I'll take a pretty heaped spoon. This is lukewarm water and mix it till it's a nice creamy consistency. It doesn't give you an exact amount, like it doesn't say five mil to so many grams. So you just have to kind of estimate and I just keep mixing until I have it like cream rather than milk. Mixy, mixy, mixy. It's still a little bit soupy. So I'll just add a bit more until it dissolves away like that. And then it's ready to give to the bird and we'll move over there. So cut. <laughs> ready? Okay, so getting ready, I've got a towel because he makes a lot of spillage. I've got my feeding modified syringe and next thing I've got to get is the bird he's making quite a bit of noise because he's hungry or he she we don't know the gender yet and I've named my bird River Song after the Doctor Who character River Song so what we do is we suck up the syringe fill it and then tip it back so that it doesn't spill and he just drinks it right out like that and as they drink it, you can tip it forward a little bit to get it further towards the bird. And you can even close your plunger. But he's spilt probably half of it. I keep the little bowl under because he will spill a lot of it. Picking it up is the secret. And then away he goes. And so as he drinks it, I just gradually start tipping it towards him. Or him or her. Them. Never assume a gender. It's a sign of aggression. So yeah, you put, you put this plunger towards him. Until he's gone, all gone, more, more. There we go. And that is how I feed my baby. And he is probably about 10, he, she, it is probably about 10 weeks old now. So he's starting to feather up real good. Almost fully feathered now. I'm keeping my baby in a container. You can show the container. And I've got a reptile heat pad here. A nice little bunny rug type blanket, a few toys, like he's got some snuggle toys to, this one's nice because it's colours of him in there. And he's just ready to get into a bigger container now because he's getting, he or she is getting big enough now to go into the next size. Well, what are you just starving, eh? So I know that the syringe is about, it's a 5mm syringe, but it's, it's never 100% full. But I know he's getting about 15 to 20 mils each evening. And when he's ready to stop, he just stops on his own. Oops, that, one didn't, that was not a very successful picking up of the there. Come back here. And away we go. Makes it so much easier than the syringe, which is just squirting all over the place and drama and stress. I was worried it was going to go down the lungs of the bird. And this, the bird gauges his own um, amount. Look at you go. Gosh, you're starving or something. I was hoping he'd lose interest in the video so I could show when he's had enough. And you can see that the bird's crop down here is getting more rounded and more full, although a lot of that is just feathers. But this, the crop gets a nice bulge in it as he fills himself. I don't know if you're spilling more than you're drinking. There's a girl. 
You can't eat it out of the side, dummy. I'll have to get the bird DNA tested yeah. and find out what gender. Yeah. And that. Hello, in the background, baby. <laughs> Human baby in the background. Come on, you must be full by now. There you go. So when he, when the bird's full, it will start to lose interest and not sort of want to have any more. And then it will just say, no, nah, I'm done. And ready to go back to bed. Sixty turns on me, six turns on me. You're not that hungry now, are you? You want any more? Oh, I'm done. Nice to back up. Yeah, there we go. There we go. You can do it. You can do it. Well, here, I'll give you the camera. Recording right now or not? It's recording. It should be. Okay. Oh, well, you tip it like that and you can have it. It just doesn't mix as good. I'm not talking about other stuff. Drink it out of there. Look. If you can figure it out, where's he going? He's done it. Oh, get him again. It was recording. Good birdie. Oh yeah, look at that. That's a good birdie. Now you gotta drink it out of here. 